హాయ్ వ్యూవర్స్ వెల్కమ్ టు మై ఛానల్ దిస్ ఇస్ శ్రీధర్ రెడ్డి ఎల్పిద్ది అసిస్టెంట్ ప్రొఫెసర్ ఆఫ్ ఫిజిక్స్ ఫ్రమ్ గవర్నమెంట్ డిగ్రీ కాలేజ్ ఫర్ ఉమెన్ నల్గొండ వెల్కమ్ టు శ్రీ క్వాంటమ్ అకాడమీ ఫీల్ ద ఫిజిక్స్ అట్ గ్లాన్స్ టుడే ఐఎమ్ గోయింగ్ టు డిస్కస్ అబౌట్ ద టాపిక్ ప్రొఫెషనల్ మోషన్ ఆఫ్ స్పిన్నింగ్ టాప్ బొంగరం యొక్క పురస్సరణ చలనము బిఫోర్ గోయింగ్ టు వాచ్ మై వీడియో ప్లీజ్ సబ్స్క్రైబ్ మై ఛానల్ ఇఫ్ యూ నాట్ ఎట్ డన్ అండ్ ప్రెస్ బెల్ ఐకన్ టు గెట్ లేటెస్ట్ అప్డేట్స్ ప్లీజ్ వాచ్ లైక్ షేర్ కామెంట్ మై వీడియోస్ Before going to explain about processional motion, let us discuss about how a spinning top rotates. One thing is, let us discuss the first thing. If you clearly observe the motion of a spinning top, initially it stands vertically and rotates about itself about an axis like this. This is called self-spinning. Self-spinning means body rotates about itself along the axis. అంటే ఒక బాడీ తన చుట్టూ తాను తిరిగితే దాన్ని మనం సెల్ఫ్ స్పిన్నింగ్ ఆత్మ భ్రమణం అంటాం జనరల్లీ స్పిన్నింగ్ టాప్ ఇనీషియల్లీ స్టాండ్స్ వర్టికల్లీ ఆన్ ద గ్రౌండ్ అండ్ రొటేట్ అబౌట్ ఇట్ సెల్ఫ్ విత్ హై స్పీడ్ యాజ్ లాంగ్ యాజ్ ఇట్స్ వెలాసిటీ రెడ్యూజెస్ ఇట్ స్లోలీ బెండ్స్ లైక్ దిస్ అంటే దాని వెలాసిటీ దాని స్పీడ్ అనేది తగ్గే కొద్దీ లైట్ గా బెండ్ అవుతుంది ఇలా ఇలా బెండ్ అవుతూ అది అగైన్ ఆల్రెడీ ఇట్ ఈస్ రొటేటింగ్ అబౌట్ ఇట్ సెల్ఫ్ ఎట్ ద సేమ్ టైమ్ ఆఫ్టర్ బెండింగ్ ఆల్సో ఇట్ రొటేట్ స్లోలీ లైక్ దిస్ దట్ మీన్స్ దేర్ ఆర్ టూ టైప్స్ ఆఫ్ రొటేషన్స్ వన్ ఈస్ సెల్ఫ్ రొటేషన్ అబౌట్ ఇట్ సెల్ఫ్ అలాంగ్ దిస్ యాక్సిస్ నంబర్ టూ ఈస్ రొటేషన్ ఆఫ్ దీస్ సెల్ఫ్ రొటేషన్ అబౌట్ అనదర్ యాక్సిస్ that means this is the axis about which it is rotating now this rotation again rotating about another axis like this that means rotation of self rotation axis that is called processional motion ante already tana chuttu thanu ila axis chuttu tirugutundi now ee axis em avutundi inko dan chuttu tirigostundi ila ante oka rotation undi ఆ రొటేషన్ ఇంకో దాని చుట్టూ తిరుగుతుంది అంటే టూ టైప్స్ ఆఫ్ రొటేషన్స్ ఉన్నాయి కదా ఇలా టూ టైప్స్ ఆఫ్ రొటేషన్స్ ని కలిపితే మనం ప్రొసెషనల్ మోషన్ పురస్సరణ చలనం అంటాం సో ప్రాపర్ డెఫినేషన్ ఫర్ ప్రొసెషనల్ మోషన్ ఈస్ ద యాక్సిస్ ఆఫ్ సెల్ఫ్ రొటేషన్ ఈస్ రొటేటింగ్ అబౌట్ అనదర్ యాక్సిస్ సో టూ యాక్సిస్ ఆఫ్ రొటేషన్స్ వన్ ఈస్ సెల్ఫ్ యాక్సిస్ ఆఫ్ రొటేషన్ and another one is processional axis means this one this is called processional axis because about this axis it is rotating again so self rotating axis and processional rotating axis if you clearly observe here two important points you have to remember one is initially it is rotating like this that means let us suppose this is a fixed point on this fixed point vertically it is rotating like this as its speed reduces and the dini speed tagutunna koddi as long as its speed reduces slowly it is bending like this and it is rotating like this now in second case also downside it is fixed here only that means initially it is rotating like this after that it is rotating like this that means in two cases downside there is a fixed point that means at that fixed point self rotation end is there only and processional motion end is also there only that means two axes are fixed at this point this is called fixed point right ante tana chuttu thanu tirigedi chivar end ikkade undi inko dan chuttu tirige dani end kuda ikkade undi ante endi two axes ends ela unnai coincide avutunnai oke daggara untunnai ఆ ఫిక్స్డ్ పాయింట్ దగ్గర ఉండాలి ఇది మోస్ట్ ఇంపార్టెంట్ సో మనకు ప్రొఫెషనల్ మోషన్ లో టూ ఇంపార్టెంట్ వన్ ఈస్ తన చుట్టూ తాను తిరగాలి తిరుగుతూ బెండ్ అవుతూ ఇంకో దాని చుట్టూ తిరగాలి అంటే టూ టైప్స్ ఆఫ్ మోషన్స్ ఉండాలి నంబర్ టూ పాయింట్ ఏంటి ఈ టూ రొటేషన్స్ కి యాక్సిస్ లు ఒక ఫిక్స్డ్ పాయింట్ దగ్గరే ఫిక్స్ అయి ఉండాలి దిస్ టైప్ ఆఫ్ మోషన్ ఈస్ కాల్ ప్రొఫెషనల్ మోషన్ ఓకే నవ్ వై ఇట్ హ్యాపెన్స్ ఎందుకు తన చుట్టూ తాను తిరుగుతూ ఇంకో దాని చుట్టూ తిరుగుతుంది వై ఇట్ ఈస్ రొటేటింగ్ అబౌట్ ఇట్ సెల్ఫ్ అండ్ రొటేటింగ్ అబౌట్ అనదర్ యాక్సిస్ 
answer is very simple as long as its speed is high it rotate about itself due to the rotational kinetic energy as long as its speed reduces that means its speed reducing means its kinetic energy is reducing as long as its kinetic energy reducing due to the gravitational attraction due to the gravitational force slowly it's pulled towards the ground ad rotate avutundi ante daniki energy undi kada aa energy anedi bhoomi yokka attraction kante ekkuga unnanta sepu it will rotate like this only but as long as it is rotating its speed is reducing na then speed slowly taggutundi kada speed taggutundi ante earth gravitational force dominate that one ఎప్పుడైతే ఎర్త్ ఫోర్స్ డామినేట్ చేసిందో అప్పుడు ఇలా తిరుగుతుంది కాస్త స్లోగా బెండ్ అవుతుంది స్లోగా బెండ్ అవుతూ వెలాస్టి ఎంత తగ్గితే అంత గ్రౌండ్ వైపు బెండ్ అవుతూ ఉంటుంది ఓకే నవ్ యూ అండర్స్టాండ్ హౌ ఇట్ ఈస్ బెండింగ్ టువర్డ్ ద గ్రౌండ్ నెక్స్ట్ క్వశ్చన్ ఓకే సార్ నవ్ ఇట్ ఈస్ రొటేటింగ్ అండ్ ఇట్ ఈస్ బెండింగ్ క్వశ్చన్ ఈస్ ఇఫ్ ఇట్ ఈస్ బెండ్స్ ఇట్స్ ఓకే దెన్ వై ఇట్ ఈస్ రొటేటింగ్ అబౌట్ అనదర్ యాక్సిస్ ఆన్సర్ ఈస్ వెరీ సింపుల్ యాక్చువల్లీ స్పిన్నింగ్ టాప్ ఈస్ pulled towards the ground because of the gravitational force so in this direction force is acting due to this force their axis torque on the spinning top ante ee force kindiki laagutundi kada ee force valla dan meeda oka torque pan chestundi due to that torque it slowly bends like this and it rotates like this due to the torque acting on the spinning top it is rotating about another axis due to the earth it is bending towards the ground due to the rotational kinetic energy it stand vertically so ikkada manaku mood important oka vela daniki speed led ankonde if it is not self rotating about itself and there is no self spinning if there is no self spinning then there is no kinetic energy in ke in that case it will directly fall on the ground oka vela daniki self spinning led ankonde energy lepothe emoddi bhoomi kindiki lagutadi kinda padipothadi so self spinning is important number 2 oka vela bhoomi kindiki lagatle if there is no gravitational force which is pulling towards the ground then what happens very simple it rotates like this only it never bends ante kada bhoomi kindiki lagutundi kabatti kindiki ostundi oka vela lagakapothe it will stay like this only number 3 sare kindiki lagutundi tirugutundi torque ledanko torque lekapothe బెండ్ అయి కింద పడిపోతుంది కానీ ఇలా ఇంకో దాని చుట్టూ తిరగదు ఇఫ్ దెర్ ఈస్ నో టార్క్ దెర్ ఈస్ నో ప్రొఫెషనల్ మోషన్ సో దీస్ ఆర్ మోస్ట్ ఇంపార్టెంట్ థింగ్స్ డ్యూ టు ద సెల్ఫ్ స్పిన్నింగ్ డ్యూ టు ద గ్రావిటేషనల్ పుల్లింగ్ డ్యూ టు ద టార్క్ బికాస్ ఆఫ్ దీస్ ఈవెంట్స్ ఏ స్పిన్నింగ్ టాప్ ప్రొసెస్ అబౌట్ అనదర్ యాక్సిస్ సి హియర్ దిస్ ఈస్ ఎ స్పిన్నింగ్ టాప్ this is the axis about which it is self rotating angular speed or angular velocity of self rotation is omega with this omega speed it is rotating like this this is the fixed point about which it is self rotating now earth is always pulling towards the ground like this because of the gravitational force as long as its speed is more it always stand vertically and self rotate about itself but as the speed slowly reduces gravitational attraction dominates now it slowly bends like this in this way it is bending but fixed point is always fixed now it is bending and self rotating at the same time this axis of self rotation is rotating about another axis like this so already there is a self rotation now this self rotation axis is rotating about another axis this type of motion is called processional motion navy blue color axis is processional axis and black color axis is self spinning axis actually spinning top is rotating about black axis now that black color axis is rotating about navy blue, blue color axis but both the axis are fixed at downside point that means about a fixed point these two axes are rotating about that fixed point processional motion is taking place now we come to the definitions what is symmetric top symmetric top is a asymmetric body rotating about an axis fixed at one point that means downside it is fixed na now this fixed point is called origin for frame of reference 
okay now what is the processional motion the axis of rotation of a spinning top itself rotate about a vertical axis the axis of rotation of spinning top itself rotates about a vertical axis is called processional motion that means here two are there already axis of rotation that means it is already rotating about an axis of rotation now that axis of rotation itself rotating about another vertical axis this type of motion is called processional motion simple ga cheppali ante already through tirugutunnatvanti axis inko daani chuttu tirigi raavadanni procession antam the axis about which the axis of rotation is spinning is called axis of precession the axis about which the axis of rotation of spinning top rotating is called axis of precession ante already oka spinning top dan chuttu adi tirige atuvanti axis deni chuttu tirugutundo danni manam axis of precession antam first due to the self spinning top stands vertically due to the gravitational force it pull toward the ground which leads to precession if there is no self spinning due to its weight it falls on the ground if there is no weight, gravitational force it stand vertically there is no precession it stand vertically like this okay now what is the gravitational force acting on the top w weight is equal to mg now that is called force so f is equal to mg what is the formula for torque tau is equal to r cross f right tau is equal to r cross f means force what is force here mg so tau is equal to r cross mg if i remove cross product then what i can write sin theta so tau is equal to r mg sin theta that is equation number 1 okay tau is equal to mg r sin theta next what is the relation between the torque and angular momentum tau is equal to dj by dt tau is torque and j is angular momentum now tau is equal to dj by dt from that i can write tau is equal to delta j by delta t tau is equal to delta j by delta t that implies bring this delta t this side now delta j is equal to tau into delta t okay from equation 1 what is equation 1 tau is equal to mg r sin theta na substitute here now delta j is equal to mg r sin theta into delta t this is equation 2 okay delta j is equal to mg r sin theta into delta t equation 2 next see here again actually this is the axis about which it is processing navy blue color axis is axis of precession black color axis is axis of self rotation okay now this red color circle is around which it is processing the path of precession okay now see here these are two lines draw from the origin to the path that points are c and c prime the angular momentum of this spinning top is j take the center point a from the draw two lines to c and c prime now the distance between a and c is r the angle between ac and ac prime is delta watch the diagram again a is the center point of the vertical path from that ac distance is r ac prime distance is also same because radius that is okay the angle between ac and ac prime is delta phi and the angle between vertical axis and momentum j is theta okay now difference between c and c prime is delta j change in momentum now see here from triangle acc prime see here from the triangle actually ac is equal to ac prime why because that is radius so ac prime is equal to ac from triangle aco see there here this is the triangle aco from the triangle find out sin theta sin theta is equal to opposite by hypotenuse what is opposite ac what is hypotenuse oc so sin theta is equal to ac by oc that implies ac means ac prime that is equal to bring this oc this side now ac is equal to oc sin theta but what is oc oc is j no so ac is equal to j sin theta 
AC is equal to J sin theta. Actually, what is the formula for arc? Arc is equal to radius into angle. Chapamu is equal to Vyasardamu into Konamu. Ani untundi, right? So, arc is equal to radius into angle. What is arc CC prime? That means delta J. See from the diagram. CC prime is arc. That means delta J is equal to radius AC into angle delta phi. Right? So, delta J is equal to AC into delta phi. Delta J is equal to what is AC? C in above equation. Delta J is equal to AC means J sin theta into delta phi. That implies put delta phi that side and brings remaining terms this side. Now, delta phi is equal to delta J by J sin theta. You got it? Delta phi is equal to delta J by J sin theta. This is equation 3. Right? Now, what is equation 2? From equation 2, delta J is equal to mgr sin theta delta t. Right? Substitute that one here. So, if you substitute equation 2 in equation 3, then what I will get? Delta phi is equal to mgr sin theta into delta t by j sin theta. Cancel sin theta sin theta, then I will get delta phi is equal to mgr into delta t by j. Bring delta t this side. Now, that implies delta phi by delta t is equal to mgr by j, right? Delta phi by delta t can be written as d phi by dt. So, d phi by dt is equal to mgr by j, right? That implies, actually what is angular velocity? Angular velocity formula is rate of change of angular displacement. That means, d phi by dt. Actually, this is called processional angular velocity. So, let it omega p. Now, processional angular velocity omega p is equal to d phi by dt. If I substitute that one, omega p is equal to d phi by dt is equal to mgr by j. Right? This is processional angular speed omega p is equal to mgr by j. But actually what is j? Angular momentum. What is the formula? j is equal to i omega. Substitute that one. Omega p is equal to mgr by i omega. Here omega is angular velocity of self spinning. That means already first it is rotating about itself now. That speed is omega. Next it is rotating about itself then it is rotating about another axis. That rotation is called processional rotation. Now, angular velocity about itself is omega. Angular velocity about another axis is omega p. So, here there is a difference. Omega means angular velocity of self spinning. Omega p is angular velocity of processional motion. If you see from above diagram, omega p is inversely proportional to i omega. It is in denominator. You can check there. That means, if I increase i, then omega p decrease. If I increase omega, omega p decreases. Right? That means, omega p decreases as i and omega increases. Ante kade entel sundi, omega ekkunte, omega p thakkunte. Omega p ante ndi, processional motion. Ante ekkwa speed to thiruutu na pudu, procession undadu. Andu kane speed ekkun nante seipu, adhi straight ga stand ayu unta di. Speed thaggutu na koddi, it will start bending. So, omega p decreases as i and omega increases. This is the processional motion of a spinning top. Right? Thank you. Please watch, share, like, comment my videos. Thank you.